This morning, just one day to go, and millions of Americans are on the move, hitting the road and the skies to get their view of the total solar eclipse. Millions expected to travel. The economic boom for those states in the path of totality could reach billions. In the skies, the FAA issuing a travel warning, anticipating high volume of traffic. Today, they expect over 44,000 flights alone. Kathy Green flying from Atlanta to Buffalo to catch the celestial event at Niagara Falls. This is the spot, and everybody knows it, but this is the spot. If you really want to see it, this is where you go. In Vermont, seven ski areas fall within the eclipse's path, with hotels having to waitlist thousands. Jay Peak calling their event the whiteout. We took our first reservations for the eclipse almost four years ago. Um, so there has been a lot of interest for an awfully long uh, period of time, and we have been sold out for a year. Cities and towns along the route of totality are expecting huge crowds in traffic. In Texas, one of the 13 states in totality, the Department of Transportation warning about congestion and distracted driving. Don't want anybody to be parking on the shoulder. Don't be wearing your glasses. In Indianapolis, the governor calling a state of emergency in anticipation of the massive crowds. The biggest issue is going to be traffic. We think it's going to back up on the interstates. And here at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, nearly 50,000 expected to arrive. Officials saying they're ready. Please come prepared and please come patient.